All right, so to bisect an angle, what we have to do is again use our compass. And we're going to set our compass to um, any measurement, it doesn't matter. But once you choose that measurement, you have to stick with it. Okay. Now, the larger you set your radius on your compass, the more accurate your question is going to be. So don't have it really, really tight. Bring it out as far as you can, but again, a reasonable size as well. We're going to set our compass to whatever uh, size you decide on, and then put it on the point of the angle we're talking about. So we want to bisect that angle, which means basically we're going to try and cut it in half. Okay, we're going to have the angle. To do that, our compass goes on the point of the angle, and we strike an arc until it cuts both of our lines. So that's the first step. We then take the compass, again making sure the measurement does not change throughout, and we have to put it on where it cuts the bottom line, and then we have to repeat that and put where, where it cuts the top line. And what we're doing each time is we're striking an arc. So we're going to strike an arc outwards, we're going to take the compass, Put it on the opposite point and strike an arc and those two arcs will cross over each other. Now where they cross over each other, if I join that back to my corner, what happens is my original angle is cut in half and it's cut in half equally. So what you've done is you've bisected that angle. 